before this video starts, I would like to say that I have coded underscore bot, um, and it would be very good if you could add it to your servers. We are trying to grow. Um, as you can see, it's at like 173 uh, servers. So yeah, if you could add it to your servers, uh, the link will be in the description below. That'd be very much appreciated. And let's go ahead and actually start with the video. So in this video, we're going to be uh, coding an unbanned command for your discord.js bots. Um, in version 14. So a while ago, I made a banned command, but I never actually made an unbanned command. And I just realized that. So yeah, let's go ahead and get started. So we're going to start by saying if command equals 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 ban or uh, unban. Uh, by the way, this is for my handler. Uh, just copy the baseline of the code, I guess you could say, for your uh, command handler. Um, and yeah, so we can do const member equals args zero. Just like that we can do const embed equals new embed builder uh that is an equals right here we can make our embed so we can do set color we'll say blue we can set a description this can be white check mark uh it will say member actually we'll do at member um just like this has been unbanned uh, all right, and then we can say right here we can say message dot guild dot bands dot fetch, and then we can say dot then async bands arrow function uh, open this up and we can say if bands dot size equals equals zero, and we can return message dot return message channel dot send. There is no one banned from the server. Just like that. We can go under that. We can say let band ID equals bands dot find ban arrow function band dot user dot ID equals equals member. Um, and then we can put a semicolon here. We can say if no band ID, uh, then we can return await message dot channel dot send. Uh, the ID stated is not banned from the server, just like that, semicolon. Then we can do await message a guild dot bands dot remove member. Um, and actually, we'll do one more thing. So right here, we can do let reason equals. We can say argument dot slice one, and then we can do dot join empty string, uh, and then we can say or uh, no reason given, uh, just like that. So then we can come into our embed. I forgot to do this. Uh, we can do reason, just pass that in. Um, and then we can also come down here and we can put a comma and we can put in our reason as well. Um, and then we're gonna go ahead and catch an error. So we can do catch error, open this up, um, return message dot channel send. Um, there was an error banning or unbanning this member just like that now we can go ahead and actually send the embed so we can stay in here and we can do await message dot channel send and we can say embeds pass in our embed just like that put a semicolon here and with that, we are done. So go ahead and restart your bot and we can test this out. All right, so now we can actually go ahead and ban the person. So uh, if you don't have this ban command already, go ahead and check out my previous videos. Um, but we can ban my alt and say testing unban command as the reason. And as you can see, it will ban the alt. So now what we can go ahead and do is we can actually unban the alt. So we can go ahead and copy the ID. We can do unban the alt and then pass in a reason to say unbanned i guess we don't have to pass in a reason you can just leave that blank if you want and as you can see it will say that the alt has been unbanned so if we go over onto the alt um we can go ahead and click open the link and as you can see i now can join the server um perfectly fine so it does in fact work if this didn't work for you please go ahead and join the help server in the description below and use the help channels uh so that the mods and i can help you out um, and yeah, if you have any other questions, leave them in the comments below, um, regarding other videos and stuff, and I'll see you guys in the next video.